something that we would normally see. A complete stranger attacking and sexually assaulting a woman walking to work. And tonight, police need your help finding him as schools warn students to be on the lookout. At 11 o'clock, good evening, everyone. I'm Jeff Gianola. And I'm Jennifer Hoff. Police say that victim, just 19 years old, had never met the man she says attacked her. It happened yesterday morning in Gresham, near the Fred Meyer at Highway 26 in Powell Valley. Our Cole Miller is live with more in this crime alert. Cole? Well, Jennifer, Jeff, good evening. A terrifying crime. Police say that man may have been armed with a gun. Those who live nearby taking notice and caution tonight. For it to happen out here, it's, it's kind of scary. Powell Valley Road, quite busy tonight. A road Cheyenne Penny occasionally travels along, now doing so even more alert. Gresham police say it's where a 19-year-old woman was sexually assaulted early Wednesday morning. It's obviously concerning the victim was walking to work and noticed that there was a person coming up and approaching her. That person, that man, unknown to her, possibly armed with a handgun. Police say she got help right away and called 911. The stranger aspect is what bothers people most, and rightfully so, and at the same time, uh, they are very rare. Police describe this attacker as white in his early to mid-20s, cleanly shaven with light-colored eyes and short blonde hair. He's also relatively short at about five foot one, was wearing dark clothing, but what may be the most telling sign, police say he has some kind of red markings on his hands. I'm not sure what the markings are, uh, not sure if they're tattoos or just pen markings or just some sort of scrapes, but uh, it was a unique feature and hopefully someone will recognize that. Nearby schools also sending home a letter to parents, reading in part, quote, the safety of our students and staff is our first priority and encouraging students to walk in pairs. As for Penny, she tells me she's considering getting a taser on top of keeping a close eye out for anything unusual. Be careful, be safe. Be paranoid at night. It's it's helpful. It's definitely helpful. Of course, anyone out there who may know anything is urged to get in touch with police, especially if you may know what those red markings are on that man's hands. Back to you. Okay, hopefully they'll catch this guy. Cole, thank mm. you. 